Hi there, welcome to QA Box. Let's test. And this video, I'll show you how to install Node.js onto your computer. So open this link. You will see these two options. The first one is latest stable version. This one is the current version means it has got the latest features, but they may not be the stable. So in this series, we are going to work on the latest stable version of Node.js. So click on this and follow the normal installation instructions. Don't change anything. The next thing that we want is an ID. And for that, we are going to use Visual Studio Code. Come to this link and download the Visual Studio Code onto your machine. Once both of these are done, open the terminal and type in the command node hyphen v and hit enter if you get a version back means everything is set up properly you can also try one more thing you can say node and hit enter now let's see one thing in here which is process so i'm going to hit enter so now you could see all the different components that are there in the node so the node version itself then the v8 we talked about in the previous video then the uv version and so on okay so to exit out from this you have to use the command process dot exit and you are out of this now to launch visual studio code at this location you have to say code space dot hit enter this is going to launch the visual studio for us at this location all right so visual studio code is launched and in my case this terminal is already open if you don't find this in your case don't worry you just have to click on terminal and click on new terminal so visual studio offers you an integrated terminal so that you don't need to go to your system terminal and then write the commands to execute your program. Now let's create a very simple program. Let's create a file. Let's give it a name app.js. And all we are going to do in here is going to log something to the console. And let's say, hello everyone. Let me save this and in order to execute this file, what do you have to do? You have to use the command in the terminal node space and the name of the file from this location. So the name of the file in our case is app.js, which is already there at this location. So all we have to say is app.js. Hit enter and you see that it is working fine means everything is set up properly all right i'll see you in the next video thank you so much